2012 Ivan Urigan 55 kilogram finals. This is 2012, so the weight classes are 55 kilograms, and the scoring is period format. Takedowns are worth one point. Feet to back is worth three points. You only have to win two periods to win the match. It is not cumulative scoring. Here in the red, we have Jamal Otar Sultanov versus Nariman Istropilov in the blue. Both these wrestlers are Russian. Here in the hardest tournament of the year in Russia, the Ivan Uregan every year. And if you're in the Uregan finals, you are a solid wrestler, but these guys have the credentials on the world level as well to back it up. Otar Sultanov would go on to win the Olympics this year at 55 kilograms. Isar Pilov won the Uregan back in 2009 and then would go on to win World Bronze the year after this in 2013. Mr. Peel of trying to find to get to a leg there. Now Ulto Sotano looking to attack. Neither guy able to get in really deep on a score yet, however. So now with time expired in the first period and no scores, we'll put 30 seconds on the clock and we will go to the ball draw. Utter Sultanov going to pull a bag and it's a red ball. So he will be able to be in the clinch. Referee blows the whistle. Butter Satanov trying to reach over to secure a double. And because he put Istropilov on his butt, will pick up the one point takedown and automatically wins the period one to zero. Kind of funny to look back on this now in the year. 2020 at those rules seems so silly but at the time this is what we dealt with this is also the camera work wrestling fans dealt with in 2012 the sport has definitely come a long way in the past decade so we restart Odor Sultanov up one period to zero over Istropilov. Istropilov kind of looking for a super duck type outside step. Odor Sultanov sprawls and is now in the front headlock position. Weighing on the back and neck of Isropilov, but the official calls a stalemate, breaks him up, and starts him back in the neutral position. Mr. Pilov firing off a little half shot. Odor Sultanov returns it. Both guys, or neither, I should say, able to get past the head hands defense of the other.
Isra Pilov definitely the one firing off more attacks. Neither guy firing off many. Oder Sultanov playing the game a little bit. The ball draw game, the clinch game. Not many wrestlers called for stalling back in 2012. Now Isra Pilov able to get to the leg, extending. Now he's got Oder Sultanov in some trouble and picks up the one point takedown. And that is the end of the second period. Mr. Pilov ties it up one period to one each period. Scored one to zero. Mr. Pilov able to get a takedown of his own before time expired. Oder Sultanov used the clinch. Third period underway. Two minutes to go. The winner of this period takes the match. So Odor Sultanov may be coming out a little more urgent this period. You see him active hands, looking for a little shuck there. And if he believes he's the better wrestler, he doesn't want this to go to the ball draw and give Israel of a 50% chance of getting to the clinch. Oder Sultanov, excuse me, Israpilov fires off a shot, but Oder Sultanov defends. Now he's trying to get an angle. You see Israpilov blocking him off with that right hand. And there he squares up. Good defense there from Israpilov. Able to fend off the go behind attempt from Oder Sultanov. Israpilov fires off a shot, but he gets extended. And Oder Sultanov steps over the top. And he's at least going to get two points for that. There you see the scoreboard flash. Oder Sultanov picking up three points. And with short time, Mr. Pilov's going to need a feet to back. But he will submit the period and the match to Jamal Oder Sultanov of Russia, the 2012 55 kilogram Ivan Yurigan Grand Prix champion.